This video clip is for you, Gabby. This is all about press ups, and this is what I uh, forgot to uh, show you at camp, so I'm really sorry about that, but hey, better late than never. You said that you find it really hard to do a full press up. I said to you I'd try and give you an idea of, of exactly how to do them. So, I'm sure, <clears throat> like most ladies, you'll be able to do the classic press up from the knees. And that it's the full press up that, that's a slight problem for you. So, how about you try this? If you've got something like a stepper or um, a step at home, you can actually gradually get your body used to pushing up its entire body weight from, 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 from the palms up into your shoulders. So, grab something like a stepper, place that in front of you, or use, use the stairs if you like. Now, I'm doing it from this angle here so you can see where my knees and feet are because that makes a big difference to be, being able to push up your body weight. So, place your hands on the stepper. Slightly wider than shoulder width apart. The, the closer your hands are, the more difficult it's going to be to push up because it ends up using your triceps and uh, restricts the range of movement and the load. So, <clears throat> have your feet quite wide apart, hands wide apart, and then just lift up through your hips. Now, obviously when you're doing a press up, you don't want your butt right up in the air eventually, okay? But, to start with, until you get confident with these, have your butt slightly higher, but really engage through your abs. Ask someone, if you want to, just to hold your either side of your hips just to help your body up, okay? So, feet up, shoulder width apart, engage your abs, and then just go down just a little way. Now the reason I've got you, got, got you to use a, um, a bench is to take that load off, because just by having, having your body on a slight incline, it does make it easier. You'll find, no joke, after practicing this every, you know, every day, that you'll eventually be able to go down that little bit lower, little bit lower, little bit lower. Once you find, you can get probably sort of halfway down towards the stepper, and then push, you, push your body weight up, then you know it's probably about time to actually take this away and actually try a classic press up. Just like that. All right, hands apart. Remember what I said, keep your feet apart, it helps to spread the load. Um, if your feet are together, it does make it a lot more difficult. Same with um, the hands being quite close together. So, feet apart, hips down, weight into your palms, shoulders down, abs in tight, and then just slowly, slowly, take it a little way, push it up, a little bit further, push it up, take it all the way down, and then eventually push it up. Okay, another way that you can build up strength as well, Gab, is just literally getting yourself into a plank position with your feet apart, about shoulder width apart. Okay, hold yourself there. Once you can hold yourself there for at least about 15, 20 seconds, then try it on your palms. Hold that, hold that, hold that. And then just hold it halfway, halfway down as well, okay? There's another way you can build up some strength through your arms and shoulders. Before you know it, coming from here, pushing up. I know it seems simple and I know it's quite daunting, but practice makes perfect, right? Give it a go, girl.